podcast discussion right now. Can men get pregnant? If it was originally a female, yeah. And then transitioned to a male. So my answer is no. Men can't get pregnant. Okay, we love our transgender okay, people. Okay, but they identify as male. We love, so we love all... Of, classified as okay, a so wait, let, don't talk over me. I love all my transgender people, but my answer is no. Um, men, ca- uh, men cannot have babies. So, why do you say men can have babies? Go. I mean, she like, thinks men can have babies, guys. This like, is Grammatically, but biologically, in grammar, obviously, no. Look up. Look at the camera. Look at the camera. Now, say that again. Obviously, no. Why can't they have babies? Because you can't nut in them. You can't nut in them, so they okay. You can nut in their sussy bussies, but they won't. You have can a nut in their sussy bussies. But what the they heck? Have a womb. Why do you? Why do you say sussy bussy? What are you? What are you? A child? I don't understand what the heck that. What did that even mean? Sussy bussy is their bussy. Their their boy bussy, which is their beady hull. I don't which know. Gets nutted stop! In stop! By stop! <laughs> Obviously, a man can't give birth to a. a, a can't give birth to a child because you're a man yeah obviously but grammatically in the sense of somebody identifies as a male they feel like a male you have to like respect what they feel like you feel like a little pink him a little twinkle toes uh so we i just did a hundred push-ups on the live and you're calling me a twinkle toes that doesn't mean i've seen cheerleader men who like take it in the ass every day be manly Oh yeah, name that doesn't mean anything. name one guy you know who there's takes a, it. There's like you bodybuilders can't... who are homo. That doesn't mean you're not still jacked and can kill somebody <sighs> in a heartbeat. Like what? But that doesn't mean that men can have babies. That doesn't make uh, that doesn't even make yeah, I anatomical know. Biologically, sense. Biologically, no. But grammatically, oh, you're, you're no, but you're people. saying yes. You literally took the position of yes. I literally just Im- said no. Yes and yes. no. Yes. No, 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 no. You're politically incorrect. You're correct. And incorrect. You need to learn. Yo, Patrice, her notification came up. Oh, I love seeing that notey. All I know is you got me bricked up with this conversation. So thank you. Thank you so much. Now I'm bricked. Not me. Bro, I'm literally I'm literally bricked now thanks to her. Thank you so much. It's literally shriveled like a shriveled. <laughs> Her new name, she's Taco Girl. Taco Girl. Who's a little taco girl? I don't even really like tacos. Oh yeah, but you're a little taco girl. Or do you want to be called sushi? Yeah. You want to be called sushi? No, because then people are going to think I'm like... Nah, I'm going to shut up. I'm going to shut up. I'm oh yeah, up. no sushi. You want to be taco girl or sushi girl? That's your answer. Neither. Okay, how about this? I want to identify as a chihuahua. We got you a gift for Valentine's Day. Here you go. Oh my god. Here Thank you go. You. You're welcome. Look, guys, she's so These happy. These are really pretty, the pink ones. I really like the baby pink. I knew you loved pink. I knew you loved pink. We got Superwoman some beautiful flowers for Valentine's. Look how pretty the Boys, this is how you treat your girlfriend. She get her flowers. So cute. Every six weeks, get her flowers. Every six weeks? My dad would get my mom every day a bouquet. Okay, that's, that's expensive. That's how you do it. That's, that's expensive. How, that's how a real man does it. My dad literally showed me how a woman uh, should be treated. Well, wait. And I'm so thankful. Every day? Every yeah, day you get her a box of chocolates. Literally, every day. He, no, my mom hates chocolates. Okay, but every day we get you. He would give my mom, like, literally a new bouquet. Once it died, new bouquet. Once it died, new bouquet. Like, every three, four days. On God. You can ask Danny. You can ask him. Who's the man? My dad. Gigi. Okay. Every time the bouquet okay, passes. now now every six months, okay, with this attitude. Oh my gosh. Get them flowers, they're still upset. Never mind, boys, don't get them anything. Actually, yeah, they're saying you're she hulk because you got huge muscles. Flex your muscles for us. You Thank are you the most jacked. I haven't worked out in like a look how, week. Look though. how jacked and beautiful her arms are. I literally haven't worked out in literally, a week. Literally, but you know what? Muscle has memory. You'll literally still be able to gain this week even more because you've had to get a lot of rest. So now you're going to be able to go hard this week. Guys, she literally has muscles. Look at my muscles. It's just horrible. It's just horrible. I just feel... I have body dysmorphia, guys. I hate myself. Last question. Is an open relationship a relationship? My answer is hell no, it's not. Yeah, because I think people will do it anyways. 
So if you're going to do it anyways, at least be honest about it. And if you're going to do it anyways, you're honestly probably going to catch an STD with being such a hoe. And then if you're going to do it anyways, then you might as well just, like, dip that shit eventually. Once you find, within the mix of, like, hoeing, a new partner. Because you don't really need that. So that's really the end goal in an open relationship is to find a new one while you're in the shitty one. That's the goal. And so my argument against that is just be single and celibate. Don't even waste your time with such a horrible energy. If you have a partner suggesting an open relationship or or anything like that or an open relationship, just dump them and move on with your life. Because well, honestly, you deserve you, better. Why would you be cheating on each other low key, uh, but not like be just don't about cheat? Them? Just just. But we all them. know that that really happens in like ninety nine percent of relationships. That's why the divorce rate is so high. That's not ninety nine. Not secret. That's not ninety nine percent. Okay, well, all almost all marriages are now ending in divorce, so it, it's not a secret. Well, so you, you know what? Well make it open. You know what? You guys have to have common values. Like, what do you value as success? Like, That's and definitely not what would make you cheat or leave the relationship. It's not about success. It's about, like, like actual values. You're talking about, like, money and shit. You're, that's not what it is. No, I'm not talking about values. A values, like, means, like, Christian values. Like, you love Jesus. Do you love Jesus? Yeah. You do? Yeah. Guys, she's admitting she's a, a Christian. Guys. Okay, no, actually, I don't like to tie anything because it's, like, I feel like... You know what? I take that back. I don't know. Like... Um, oh, are no you backsliding no on the faith right now? No, I just don't want to have any political or uh, religious. It's okay, okay, but the true you Christian. You forced me to basically say I was Christian. I don't know if you I guys didn't can see force my you. face, but like, I don't want to be anything. But like, I'll openly say anything. I love Jesus. What the heck? I'll openly say that. I don't care, because uh, you know what? At the end of the day, um, I do, and I'm not gonna lie about who I am. But, yeah, I know. I'm not saying a lie about who you are. I'm just saying you don't need to rub anything into anybody else's face. No, but don't cap if you ain't. Okay, well, you just literally forced me. You're like, you're Christian, right? And I was like, okay, I think the answer is yes. Okay, do you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? I have no comments about religion or politics. I'm not even gonna... She's like, I don't on, even want to entertain anybody's weird she's on the She's on the fence. Oh, I love saying sussy bussy now. No! <laughs> no! We just normalize. Yes. Do not say the word sussy bussy in my comments. If I see you saying that, I'm gonna cry and she's gonna peg me. Please don't say it. Please. Oh my god, you just got your thing full of makeup. Who? My hat? Yeah. Uh, check, check, check. Yeah, I can see it. It's on the side. Is it bad? Can I get it off? No, makeup doesn't come off. It has oil on it. I got it from my baby sister. Just kept saying, Samari's a sussy bussy. <laughs> I was like, yes, he is. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> I'm a sussy bussy? Yeah. Stop. I mean, you have a suspicious booty. I have a suspicious booty? Like, Why do girl can tell. Are you telling me? Okay, so wait. Wait a minute. You're telling me that girls love bo booty? No, I'm telling you. They think you're sussy, and it's sus, and it's so, they call it sussy, and then bussy. Okay, but I can it. squat 275 pounds. How much can you squat? Anything. No, but you can't squat. How many miles can you run? I can run six miles straight without stopping. Anything. Seven miles per hour the entire time. I How many? a chopper. I don't need to get. Okay. I to run. Okay, but I, I can. Chopper, I can literally. Releases the ladder. I can dunk a basketball on an eleven foot rim. How many? What? How many feet can you dunk on? Exactly, and you're calling me sussy bussy? No. If anything, I'm the alpha, and you are my beta female. So learn. It's not the definition of sussy bussy. I don't know if you guys are getting it. I, I don't think he's getting. It. I am getting it. She's trying to say, I'm beta. I'm not. That's not what it means. Oh my god. It means... Okay, never mind. Yo, let's get it. Let's get it. Yo, I am a girl, and that is my boyfriend in the picture. Okay, that's what's up. You should get your boyfriend a him hat. Go to prettydam.shop. Get him a hat right here that says him. It's on my website, prettydam.shop. Make sure you go get a hat. We are literally almost out of orders, so make sure you go order now before we are sold out. Let's go. No, chill. What about it? Chill, chill. Oh, there goes the camera. Oh, did it? So hard.